Here we have the world's most difficult jigsaw puzzle. What makes it so difficult is that, of course, there's a lot of similar kitty cats, but it's also reversible. And so each puzzle piece has a picture on the back instead of a plain back. So the first thing I did to try to start solving this is, of course, I found all the outside framework and assembled the frame. Now, I did discover that the lower right-hand corner on the reverse is actually the upper right-hand, upper left-hand corner. And so I, th I thought, well, let's make sure I'm putting this together right. And I did discover that the upper right-hand corner is an individual corner and the lower left-hand corner is an individual corner. So I'm sure that I have the framework done correctly. The next thing I did was I matched all the puzzle pieces into pairs. And so each one of these piles is a pair of puzzle pieces. And for example, here's a pair of white pieces. And when you flip them over, the corresponding side is gray. Now some pieces don't have a match. And those are the ones here in the middle. And I assume that they are going to be in the very center part of the puzzle. For example, you can see this one has orange and white. And you flip it over and it has orange and white. I did, a start, I did start assembling the kitty cats, thinking that would help. And so we have an orange cat, a black and white cat. In the reverse is this gray cat and tan cat. If you flip this over, we'll have the orange cat, the black and white cat. So I th assumed if I can find where this one goes, I'll know where this one goes. And so each one of these, for example, here's white cat and part of a cat. You flip this over and it's the white cat. Now in order to help me in getting this far along, I did make a chart. I used grid, grid paper. I numbered 1 through 23 for all the pieces along the bottom, 1 through 23 for all the pieces along the side. And then when I started here, I found this piece that I could be sure of, and I marked it A. I counted over 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, slot 19. And then if I come over here, I find slot 19, and it was where the reverse went. And that worked out fine, so I got as far as uh, about letter H or J, and then I discovered, okay, I'm on the right track. So I have gotten far enough along. I have the corners pretty well done. And I have a pretty good start on the middle there. So if you're doing one of these double-sided difficult puzzles, and this is the first time I've ever done one, I hope that you find this helpful. And uh, thanks for watching.